It's a Monday. No, actually, it's not Monday. Because what about now? It's 2.33 in the morning, in the a.m. It's 2.33 in the a.m. See what I mean? So technically, it's Tuesday morning. You know what I mean? Oh, that's a whole bunch of reactions for you guys. You know what I mean? So you know what? Let's get into it. What's up, guys? How you guys doing today? I hope you're having a great day or night, whatever part of the world you are watching this reaction. Now today, I'm about to get into Belinda Carlisle, Heaven is a Place on Earth. So you know what? Let's go. Ooh, baby, do you know what that's worth? Ooh, heaven is a place on earth. They say
that is my first time reacting to Belinda. Wow. And I really like the song. I like what she's singing about. I like the energy in the song. Like, listen, this is a song I could put on where I just sit there and just dance to all day. Do you know what I mean? Right. So, for those of you that don't know, like myself, about Belinda, I've searched some information about her so that we can learn together who Belinda is, how she came about creating this amazing song here that I just finished reacting to. So let's go. So it says, Belinda Jo Carlisle, born August 17, 1958, is an American singer. She gained worldwide fame as the lead singer of the Go-Go's, one of the most successful all-female bands in history, and went on to have a prolific career as a solo artist of the Go-Go's. Okay, I'm going to have to search them up, maybe after this reaction and see who they are. Um, raised in Southern California, Carl Lissell began her music career in 1977 as the drummer of Los Angeles punk band The Germs and went on to join the Go-Go's as the lead singer after the band's formation in 1978. Okay, she's been doing her thing for a minute, you know. With their chart-topping debut release, Beauty and the Beast, Ah, Beauty and the Bee, okay. In 1981, I thought they were going to say Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> in 1981, the music group helped popularize new wave music in the United States and were the first all female band in history who wrote their own songs and played their own instruments to achieve a number one album. Wow, that's big things right there, you know. Um, the Go Go's have sold over 7 million records worldwide. After the dissolution of the Go-Go's in 1985, Carly went on to have a successful solo career with radio hits such as Mad About You, I Get Weak, Circle in the Sand, Leave a Light On, Heaven is a Place on Earth, which is the one I just finished reacting to, um, among others which were major success in the United States, United Kingdom and internationally as well. Her autobiography, Lips Unsealed, published in June 2010, was a New York Best Time seller, so she also wrote a book as well. Hmm. Um, on, August 20, uh, on August 11th, 2011, as a member of the go go she received a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Okay, so her name's up there, boy. Way. Okay, so you know what? Let's check out... Okay, but well she lives in Bangkok, Thailand. Because uh, it says American, I assume she was living in America, but she lives in Thailand. Okay. Ah, so the genres that she's done is new wave, pop, pop rock, hardcore punk. That's early, it says in brackets. Okay, she's been doing her thing since 1977 to the present time. So let's uh, get a bit of info on the actual song. So it says, Heaven is a Place on Earth is a song recorded by American singer Belinda Carlisle for her second studio album, he um, album Heaven on Earth, 1987, which by uh, written by Rick Noels and Ellen Shipley. The song was released as the lead single from the Heaven on Earth album on September 18, 1987, and it hit number one on the US Billboard Hot 100 in December 5th, 1987, becoming Carly Soul's only US chart topper to date. Okay, so she only had one. Uh, a month later, it hit number one in the United Kingdom, where it held the top spot of the UK singles charts for two weeks. Okay, over here. Hmm. The song was nominated for the Grammy Award for Best Female Pop Vocal Performance in 1988, but lost to Whitney Houston's I Wanna Dance With Somebody. Hmm. Wow. Right, that's composition right there, boy. Damn. Um, in 2017, shortlist Dave's Forbes list the song as containing one of the greatest key changes in music history. Mm. So this song is big. This song just ain't a song. This song has has certain things to it. This song seems to have even left its mark in history in the past. Wow. Um, even the things that she's done as well accomplished as a female artist, you know, alongside her band The Go Go's. Mm. In 2015, Carlos re-recorded a song as an acoustic ballad. The version appeared on her 2017 album, Wild Shores, an album which combined acoustic tracks with the world, world beats and traditional Sikh chants. Okay, okay. Wow. This song here is a lovely song. I love it. I love it. For sure. I've got to say, shout out to the person who requested this because 
<laughs> if it wasn't for you, I won't know about this song. But you know what? You guys, let me know what you thought about this one here in the comments. And until the next time, I'm out. Peace. Now take it. Door busted open, my man still rang on the doorbell Boy, you must want to end up in so I can tell with no light is far But I still manoeuvre nice like a car in the car park Let me put my torchlight on, there's some things need to get me some Come on, grab anything I see, things look appealing to me You must nearly, but those things look appealing to me Get the ass about one